If you're short on time, an EMOM workout might be good for you. That stands for every minute on the minute. So this is a 10 minute workout. So obviously intensity will be key to get the most out of that workout. You wanna warm up at the beginning, stretch at the end. So at the top of each minute, we're gonna do one rep with a medium set of dumbbells. Squat, step or jump back, push up on the knees or toes, alternating row, step or jump in, stand up, curl, press, down, and squat. So the first couple of times through, I'm gonna show option one, where we're stepping back and doing the push up on the knees, and then I'm gonna kick it to high gear on the rest of the intervals. So the remainder of the minute after that rep is going to be cardio, so push yourself on your cardio. So the exercise with a medium set of dumbbells is a squat, Step or jump back, push up on the knees or toes, then we're going to row, row, come up, step or jump in, curl, press, down, and squat. So that's going to be at the top of each minute, and the remainder of the minute is cardio. Again, the first two times through, I'm going option one, low impact, and then I'm going to kick it into high gear. Work as hard as you can, grab a medium set of dumbbells, let's begin. In four, three, two, let's go. So this is option one, squat, step it back, drop it to the knees, push up. Then we're gonna row, and row, come up on the toes. Step it in, bicep curl, shoulder press, and squat. And then the rest of the minute, going to be a cardio move, total body extension. Option one, low impact. Exhale up, inhale down. Option two, jump in at the top. Exhale up and inhale down. 20 seconds to go. I'm going to go with option one one more time and then I'm going to kick it into high gear. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two. Grab your medium dumbbells. Second time. Squat. Step it back. Drop to the knees. Push up. Row. Row. Come up on the toes. Step it in. Curl. Press. Down. Squat. Jumping jacks. Option one is low. Jack, jack, exhale, inhale. Option two is high. Jack, jack, exhale one way, inhale up. Option three, jack and touch. Jack and touch. 20 seconds. So next rep, I'm gonna kick it into high gear. Option two, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, grab your medium dumbbells. Squat, step or jump it back. Push up on the knees or the toes. Row, row, step or jump it in. Curl, press, down, squat. Pop squats. Option one, out, out, in, in, right. Exhale, inhale. Option two. Touch your thighs. Inhale down, exhale out. Option three. Alternate, touch to the ground. Inhale down, exhale out. 20. Woo! Work as hard as you can. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, grab your medium dumbbells. Cool. Squat. Step or jump it back. Push up on the knees or the toes. Then row, row, step or jump it in. Curl, press, down, and squat. Cardio for the rest of the minute. Squat it over, option one. Squat, step. Squat, step. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Option two. Jump it side to side. Exhale one way. Inhale, left. Option three. 
seven, six, five, four, three, two. Grab your medium dumbbells. Number five, squat. Step or jump it back. Push up on the knees and the toes. Row. Knees or toes, row, row, 
So that one rep at the top of each minute, medium dumbbells, they should feel challenging, strengthening a lot of muscles in your body because we need muscle as we get older, especially, but always. And then the remainder of each minute is high intensity cardio intervals. So remember, you do need to push yourself outside your comfort zone, especially if the workout is short. We don't want anything to feel comfortable. Then you just maintain your current fitness level, but we want to push yourself outside that comfort zone to create the most calorie burn, afterburn, and those weights should feel challenging to really build some muscle. So if you only have 10 minutes, that's an amazing workout. I'm pretty sweaty and you've done everything, your weights, your cardio. Warm up at the beginning, stretch at the end. Um, and I hope you loved that. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Share it with a friend who might find the workout helpful. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of my free nutrition and fitness content this fall. Have a beautiful day and I'll see you next week.